Well, we don't have a heading bug, we just re align this with the runway. Or with yeah. the, the magnetic with, compass. With the magnetic compasses. Because it's, it's a uh, directional gyro, which means there's a, a gyroscope in there that's spinning at high revolution, and it's being driven by the vacuum pressure that engine generates through a vacuum pump. So uh, how come there's no vacuum pump in the other one? Because the HSI, or the uh, heading indicator, is actually a digital... Uh, gate and it has an electronic. Well, they just remove it because it's, the, it's electronic. Yes, exactly. They have an electronic gyro inside of that. Because you don't want the backup in case the electronics go out. Um. Well, they had a backup battery. <laughs> All right. And they had a backup uh, gauge. Both of them were able to display heading. Bravo, Bravo, just entering the downwind for a self departure. And it's. VFR only airplane, so if it goes out, you just land. <laughs> ah, sweet. All right, flight controls. Southside traffic, Skyhawk 6852, hotel turning on runway 34, touch and go south valley. Free and correct? Yeah. We're just looking at this guy doing it. Touch, touch and, go? and go, yeah. Okay. Fuel selector, proper tank. Keep it on the right tank. We're still fuller in that one. Yes. Although it is indicating a little uh, inaccurate compared to the left side. Okay. Um, trim, take off. Uh, traffic, Archer 970, Whiskey Charlie is turning crosswind to runway 34, so valid traffic. Let's see it. He's not dead yet! Okay, there we go. That was a long one. Thank you, Hilda. It's power too long. Noted. Noted. Alright. Mixture. Full And we'll set best power at 2000 RPM. Okay. Uh, let's go up. <laughs> it wobbles. All right. Perfect. Look at this guy. Whoa. That is wild. That's an amphibious aircraft. Amphibious? You can land on the water? Yep. Just because it's like a boat on the bottom? Yep. Whoa, that's crazy. And the engines are up top, so you don't need to worry about it. Leaning to one side heavily. It, it's got to lean, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, it's like I'm not built for the ground anymore. All right, throttle 2,000 RPM. Max test. That's a very slight drop. South Valley traffic, uh, Archer 970 with King Charlie. It's turning okay. to the east to report South Valley traffic. Cool. Engine instrument, so M meter, check. Left on runway 34. Check, all right, that's wind right there. Thank you. Um. Idle, check closed. South Valley traffic, Archer 970 Whiskey Charlie is turning, is going to turn final to runway 34 South Valley traffic. Throttle friction adjust, that's good. Doors, windows, close and lock. Probes, landing light. I'll lock my uh, here in a minute. We get closer. Okay. Time record. Okay, I have the time recorded. Brakes release. All right. Abort plan ready.
Okay, what is the abort plan? The abort plan is... traffic, Kremlin, Charlie Fox, Charlie Moscow, turn crossing and departing to the north. Oh, that's such a sweet airplane. A Grumman G44A Goose. Is that where you, that just took off? Yeah. South Valley traffic, commuter 776 Sierra Alpha at North Hangars, taxiing to And he's going to Vancouver. Bravo, South Valley. Wow. Um, abort plan. If uh, before rotation we had experienced any trouble with the engine, we abort by not taking off. If after rotation, and there's still enough runway left, we land back on the runway. If there's not enough runway left, we will have to search for a smooth landing spot after the runway. Okay. So, we'll just be remaining in the pattern. Practicing landings. Practicing landings. Perfect. Let's get, get a couple good ones in today, huh? That's the plan. I like it. All right, so there's a guy on final or base. He's turning final in a sec. Should I just hold short then? Yeah, we can hold short. South on Crest, Skyhawk 6852 Hotel, final runway 34, full stop, South LA. Full stop? That's perfect. Good for you, man. South Valley traffic, Archer 970 Whiskey Charlie is turning crosswind to runway uh, 34, South Valley traffic. Hyper Archer. It's just a newer version of this. Yeah. South Valley traffic, Supercata 5510 Charlie, 4 miles to the southeast of the ground. So he's uh, close to, or do we just take off before this other guy? Uh, I would say that after this guy takes off, or um, clears the runway rather, we can go ahead and take Archer off. 970 Whiskey Charlie is turning uh, down Wait till he clears the runway. runway yeah. three, uh, three I was just straight in. Straight going straight. Oh yeah, he's still up there. Just turned downwind. Oh, okay. I can see him. Alright. Alright, rotation speed about, what, 65 in this one? Uh, 55 to 60. Just, just put some yeah. back pressure on there. Yeah, just wait so for it to take off. 52 to 63. So yeah, around 55, give it a little back okay. pressure, be real patient. Yeah. Okay. A little bit of right rudder. A little bit of right rudder. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Alright, I gotta call this. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, departing one way, 34 South Valley. Southside traffic, 6852 Hotel, on Alpha 2, taxing to the Seal Ponce, Alpha 2. Okay, final is clear. Closing the, the door. Okay. Okay, latch. We're locked. Here we go. Power. South Valley traffic. Uh, Archer Airspeed. Whiskey Charlie is turning Alive. to runway 34, South Valley traffic. Back pressure, ooh. Oh, it's a little breezy. South Valley traffic, Archer 970 Whiskey Charlie is turning a final to uh, active runway 34 South Valley traffic. There we go. Remaining in pattern.
We are not climbing super fast. Not nearly as fast as we used to, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yep. Hotter it gets. Probably traffic at 1090 South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, left downwind South Valley. Oh, I forgot to say 34. Okay. So, it looks like I'm not even going to get up to 90. <laughs> oh, I think you will. We got 200 feet, a little more room before we begin our power reduction. Oh, it's a little close. I thought it was wide, and so I came back in a little bit. It looks like too much. Now we're at 55. Alright, so now pull power? We're yep. going to beam the captain's desk. Getting his chairs. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, uh, base 3-4 South Valley. Oh, I need a notch of flaps. South Valley Traffic, Cherokee, 5923 Whiskey, final 3-4 South Valley. Oh, a little high. Oh, actually, doesn't look too bad. Oh, geez. It's going to be a go-around. Yeah. That was way high. What do you think caused that? I was still fast. Um, and I didn't do my last notch of flaps, for sure. Didn't do the last notch. I think, I think what happened that attributed to you being high was the comment you made actually was very accurate. You're close. The runway. Didn't yeah. Pattern. So as you, you, you kind of maintain that proximity, the entire pattern. Yeah, okay. Which... Yeah, when we were turning out here, I felt like I was kind of far, but then like I didn't, I didn't meaningfully turn towards the runway. I just like hugged it and got closer the whole time for yeah. some reason. And I think that's what did it. So now you know. Let's fix it. <laughs> oh, it's so high. I'll turn it right away. And there are things you can do too. I was like, I was trying to cut power and get lower. I guess I get it. I could have done that more, more heavy, more heavy-handed. Yeah. I'm in control, right? Yes, you are. That's the whole goal here. Is it the, for a second there? It looked. It looked like it was good, but then I didn't do the last notch of flaps because I was too worried about the height. <laughs> That's all right. First time, a couple weeks. That's true. It's been a couple weeks. I was in New York. It was fantastic. <laughs> so much fun. I highly recommend going if you haven't. Well, we maybe we'll get there one day. All right. <laughs> I'm going to Boston, actually, this week. Oh, wow. For work or what? Oh, uh, my grandma and uncle live there. Okay. Where my mom's from. Looks a lot better. 
Yeah. Boston. South Valley, Sky Hockey 003 Bravo, radio check, please. Hear you. Thank you. How polite. I hear you, fucker. <laughs> yeah, see if, uh, Six Sierra Alpha, are you ready to go? I'll follow you, doing some uh, a bit. extra steps here. Okay, that's fine. South Valley Airport, Skyhawk 8003 Bravo, departing runway 34. Now you're flying away. Did you mean to do that? Yes. Okay. I was getting close. I feel like I was close. I'm South Valley Traffic, Super Cab, 551 Sierra Charlie is uh, over Harriman, 6800 Southeast down, South Valley. All right. South Valley Traffic, 5923 Whiskey, base 34 South Valley. South Valley Traffic, Skyhawk 8003 Bravo is departing runway 34, exiting to the west. And one thing is that you're starting this base turn a little too soon, too. Too soon? Yeah, I think so. Just oh, a little. okay. Well, let's make it a little wider then. There you go. This looks better. Come in slow. Shooting for about 5,000, between 5,000 and 5,100 from base to final. Kind of give you a target. Oh, I'm still high there. So a little bit high. Yep. Let's reduce power. There you go. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 592 through Ruski. Final 3 4 South Valley. South Valley, 0 3 Bravo, Bain's crosswind to the west. The heck did you say, dude? Alright, this doesn't look too bad. Okay, flaps down. Off the off the brakes. Oh. Off the brakes. Oh jeez. On the rudders, but not off the brakes. <laughs> my left foot was uh yeah, going a little feet. wild there. Yeah, my feet were in the wrong spot. Well my left foot was gentle. Can't yank it off until it's ready. Lower the nose, lower the nose. There you go. Okay, so I was doing too much back pressure. Way too much on the takeoff there. Okay. Yeah, I was not patient that time. I was still a little nervous from the freaking rudder. South okay. Valley, Helicopter 713 Uniform is four and a half miles to the east over I. What I need you to do um, prior to landing is just kind of put your heels, relax your heels a little bit lower, put your toes lower on the pedals. Yeah, yeah, my, yeah I definitely know what the issue was. My freaking, my left foot was high and I was pressing with my toe. Got it. And I did not adjust it because I was nervous. Okay, no problem, <laughs> now you know. So, um, that looked pretty good. Um, I would say you, you kind of froze up on the flare there. You, you flared, it went back up, you froze it, and then it came back down, but then you just held it there. You gotta manipulate that throughout the whole process. So, um, I, fl I, I guess, did I leave a little too much power in? Uh, you know, I actually think your power was fine. Um, okay. It was just a little too... Uh, Did I stop flaring and I should have kept going more? It was a combination, actually. You, you flared a little too much, the airplane went up, so you yeah. relaxed the flare, but then that's where you stopped. And I should have, let after relaxing, come back come, slower? Yeah, come back again. Okay. That's right. Well, I got on the ground. Yeah, no, that was great. That's what I'm happy about. Watch your speed. We can't climb faster by pulling back. We gotta maintain EY. There you go. Yeah. A little counterintuitive. Is. And that's uh that's a trap that people get into. 
Yeah. I'm not climbing, so I pull back. That's... You can't do that. All right. Landing number one. <clears throat> and don't be afraid to wheelie down the runway. Okay, just because the nose is up doesn't mean the airplane's ready to fly. Oh, okay, because the power's off. Yeah, just wheelie. Just keep keep the mains on the ground and let the airplane come off. All right, I'll wheelie. All right. Well, if I you know, don't do perfect landings from here on out, I will do it. Or no, I'd have to... It'd be one thing to practice, right? I think you should wheelie on every takeoff and every landing. What? Yeah. That's preposterous. <laughs> Southside traffic, Skyhawk 6852 Hotel at the fuel pump. Damn, coming. Over the Southside. I feel like I hugged that runway. South Valley helicopter 713 uniform is one mile east of the airfield, inbound for midfield cross at 5,400. We'll do a direct entry to the left downwind for taxiway Alpha parallel 34. South Valley commuter 776 here, also turning crosswind for runway 34, closed loop traffic, South Valley. All right, tell me what speed are you shooting for on short final there? Short final, uh, 75. Okay, 70 could be good. 70 would be good? Yep. Okay. To begin your descent, so what you're doing here is you're lowering power and introducing flaps, but you're not letting the nose drop. So you're maintaining your altitude until you turn base. That's why we're coming in high every time. Okay. This time I was trying to focus on uh, not doing base too soon. Got it. To let the nose drop. Do another notch of flaps. Pull we'll power a little more. Stop there you go. Helicopter 713 uniform has that downwind traffic in sight, no factor. Now we're in a descent. <laughs> yes! <laughs> That's what I wanted. Stop by traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, uh, final 34 South Valley. I was wide. I was not perpendicular. This trajectory looks pretty good though. I, maybe even a little low now. We'll see. Well, I won't do flaps for another second or two. Cool. All right, now. Now a little low. Just a little bit of power, eh? South Valley, helicopter 713, uniform, left base, the final taxiway, Alpha, parallel 34. South Valley traffic, Skyhawk 5633, Romeo is taxiing from the South Hangars to runway 34 via Bravo, South Valley. All right, we'll just go around on that one. That, that was a gust of wind, that wasn't you. We just got a slight gust of wind. <laughs> and it actually was a tailwind. I don't know if you noticed it. I didn't. I was looking at the ground. Job on the go around. Thanks, man. South Valley, commuter 776 Sierra Alpha turning base for runway 34, touch and go, South Valley. Wish it was a touch and go. Dang it. Get on this next one. <laughs> Every time we're getting one piece of information, we're putting it together. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, left crosswind, South Valley. So a little bit of right rudder pressure South Valley, commuter 776. throughout the entire phase of flight okay. is going to be great. <laughs> especially during this this climb. Um, and especially at high density altitudes when the performance of the aircraft is already poor. you got to maximize it by streamlining the rudder. And we talked about that on our last flight. Yeah, I think it's definitely warmer today. And it definitely is warmer. <laughs> well, here's the thing though, like, even when I know it's not going to be perfect or whatever, I'm way less nervous while in that final ap that approach. Yeah. 
looking at the ground, I'm not like, oh damn it, oh damn it. Yeah. Here comes the ground, ground, what do I do? <laughs> yeah. yeah. So that's good. No, that's great. It's it's half the battle is your mental um, situation. Mental status, I guess. Yeah. Okay, this is our third go around here, third uh, pattern. Every pattern takes about six minutes, five to six minutes. Yeah. And every 15 minutes we should be switching gas. So let's run our checklist, switch the tanks. Yes. Best tank, uh, undercarriage fixed mixture, same. Top fixed. Stay place land over there on the runway. Perfect. All right. And one thing I haven't noticed you do at all today is trim, too. I think that might help. You seem to be fighting the airplane a lot. Trim, eh? But I feel like it would be, like, constant. Is that ideal? Yeah, I, I trim on every leg of the pattern. <laughs> oh. Well, look at you, Randy. And actually, on short final, I gave it just a little nose-up trim. All right, here we go. Not your flaps. Let's let the let's let the nose drop, eh? Yeah, push it forward. There you go. That's what we need. <laughs> South Valley traffic, Cherokee five nine two three whiskey, base three four South Valley. Let's go. More flaps. Now we're looking at the ground. South Valley traffic, experimental five, Bravo, Bravo, the point of the mountain, five thousand nine hundred feet inbound for landing. So, so. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, final 34 South Valley. South Valley traffic, Skyhawk, 33 Romeo is holding short, 34 South Valley. Hello. There you go. Oh. Okay, we can. We'll just uh, go around, eh? Okay. Skip the nacho flaps. <laughs> There's my patented uh, death trap. Let's wait till we get to VY. South Valley traffic sky, Push forward slightly on the nose forward, there. South Valley. There you go. There's VY. Last notch. Dang it! Jake actually made a common. Uh, error that you just made as well, and that is to try and go, uh, and unintentionally go from flaps full almost to flaps all the way down. In fact, he actually went flaps all the way down. He went from flaps full um, to the second notch, but it was happened so abruptly prior to, you know, being able to get power and get, get speed and that sort of thing, so you kind of felt the sinking action of the airplane. Don't be so quick to react with flaps. Make sure the airplane's flying first, and then go ahead and retract flaps. The first notch has to be retracted pretty quick. Yeah, which is I tried to do. I freaking, I always, like, I, I would skip that first one on the other plane yeah. quite often as well. I, just, I remember. I'm just, uh... Got PTSD, huh? Too much. Give it too much uh, downward force. I just need to let it fall, I guess. Watch your nose. Go. Um, I do also notice on these landings, consistently you're coming in at a low approach angle. Yeah. And so I think what will help you is coming in at a, like a medium slope angle. Or normal, I guess you could say. Um, so let's make sure that we're planning to be about 5,000 to 5,100 as we're making that base to final turn. Was I high on that part a again? A little bit high, yeah. Or sorry, a little bit low. I was low? Yep. 
5,100 on base? Yes. Fine. Fine. <laughs> I'll do it. <laughs> yeah, if you say so. I didn't hear a single thing that guy said. He's left crosswind right behind us. Oh, okay. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 whiskey, left downwind, South Valley. Ah, oh, 3 4. Gotta remember. Gotta remember. Okay, this one we're gonna land. So with that one, when, it, when there was a gust of wind, was I almost good? Oh yeah, that was a great approach and landing uh, to landing. It's just, it seemed like we just got a little gust from the back. Yeah. And it put the airplane kind of tilted in a wheelbarrow effect. Felt weird. It, it did feel weird. And you can correct for that as you gain experience, but in a pre-solo situation, it's best to do what you did, and that is go around. Going around, kind of a theme. Hey, okay, we're climbing a lot. Where are we going? Um, we're going to San Diego. <laughs> 5,800, what the hell? Just extend this a little bit. Okay, 5,100 on <laughs> Well, dang it. Right before your base to final turn. Oh, okay. About between 5,000 and 5,100. Gives us 500 feet off the ground, which is about where you should be turning. Salvat, traffic, Cherokee, 5,923, whiskey, base, 34, Salvat. And that's assuming that your pattern is within its boundary as well, which on this one it looks like it is. Yeah, let's make that assumption. It's a little fast, I feel. Flaps will help. Well, we'll find out, won't we? This looks great. 5100, we're about to start our turn. Oh, good. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, final 34 South Valley. Nice. Yep, we're getting low quick. Good. We'll pitch up. Speed, there you go. That's not flaps. Just stay here for a sec. Because we're still going fast. Okay. Jordan, that was sweet. Oh, fuck yes! Flaps down. Okay, not touching the brakes. Perfect. <laughs> I stayed on the center line and everything. Oh, oh, oh fuck, I'm messing it up! Okay, be gentle on this rotation. Wheelie, remember. Oh, let's pop this wheelie. See, it even popped off the ground even better on that one because we waited a little longer. Oh my days, I did it. <laughs> nice. Good job. Thanks. I'm happy about that one. Good. Nice. So, I guess I did things right. When I left in the power a little bit and then started pulling at the right time. Yeah. yeah no, that was great. So the power, you know, we had to keep it in longer than normal just because we were on the lower. I, I, I took out too much on base, I think, right? I, I think so. Yeah. Ooh, too much bank. Put a right rudder. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Always. 
Um, yeah, I think I think if you leave it at 2,000 maybe on base. Okay. Let's try that. Because like, in my mind, I'm like, don't go too fast. So I pull the power, and it's been, it's made me low every time, I think. And keep in mind, too, at higher density altitude days on a like a real hot day like it is today, you'll do you sink so quicker? You, you do. You lose performance quicker. And so you need extra power. Okay. Something to keep in mind. And so when I say, you know, 2,000, that's a rough estimate as to where you need to be and every day is going to change. Okay. Plus, we're not in the 180, so... Exactly. The RPMs count for a little less, right? That's right. All right, let's get to 56 here. Make a radio call, let them know you're in left down with 3-4. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, left downwind 3-4 South Valley. I'm going to take it off. Mess up just a little. All right, we're at about 56. Start pulling. Captain's bars are about off the wing there. There we go. This is going to be a good one. Um, point down, buddy. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, base 34 South Valley. Hey, come on, let's go 51. Turn a little bit more. You're still not quite perpendicular. Oh, fine. South Valley, commuter 776 Sierra Alpha, turning crosswind for runway 34 South Valley. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, final 34 South Valley. Traffic Skyhawk 33 Romeo is near Point of the Mountain, traveling southbound, last call south valley. South Valley Traffic, Sears 475 Charlie Delta Taxi from the FBO to uh, runway 34 via Bravo uh, Alpha Alpha 1, South Valley. Nice. That's center line, eh? Wait. <laughs> oh, yes. But on that one, you. Can you tell what happened? South Valley commuter 7 um, Too much rudder? Uh, well, let's talk about what happened to the airplane before you talk about oh, what yeah, caused I could, it. Like when I, when I kind of went off to the right a little bit, no, I don't know what happened. We bounced. We uh, bounced. On what? On the ground. We bounced on the runway. I did? Yeah. So oh. what I mean is that you came in, you actually had a little uh, power application there still. When we touched down, you had power, and when you went to go flare more, that power caused us to go in the air probably maybe a foot. Okay. And then we settled back down again because our, our airspeed depleted. I did not feel that bounce. Well, I didn't I didn't realize that the wheel came back up anyway. Yeah. Yeah, it did. Um, which is fine. That can happen. I was wheeling, Grandy. <laughs> you told me to do that, yeah. remember? Uh, let me define what wheeling is. <laughs> <laughs> um, and it's fine. It's just if you bounce again... You need to go around. Okay, but, but if you, but if, 
I'm not realizing it. Maybe say like the bounce. Like quiet, like or something. I just don't want to. Yeah. Okay. If I, because I honestly I didn't. Re I feel I felt like um, we touched down and then I kind of felt like a little lift up, but I thought like it was just kind of you could feel the up the pressure that you could feel. Yeah, you'll you'll definitely. There's a distinct difference between feeling the ground and and what's you know the vibrations under your butt as opposed to the air. It's okay. smooth. You could totally tell the difference in that transition. Right oh. now, it's pretty smooth. Okay. Once you touch the ground, you'll start to feel the, the vibration of the airplane. And if you lift off, the vibration actually goes away. So that'll be a good indication. Okay. Um, I'll try to look out for it. There's, uh, like I said, I can get more information uh, processes every time I do it, so... Yes, that's right. But... I landed. That was super sweet. So, the, 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 uh, the thing about the bounces, though, is that... It's dangerous. It can be dangerous. Because it can, you can do it again and again, right? You start to porpoise, and each one, each successive porpoise becomes exponentially worse. And on the third one, generally, it's a, a prop strike. And generally, porpoises are known as assholes. <laughs> I haven't heard that one, but... <laughs> oh, really? Is that, like... Maybe, the, the maybe I'm mistaken. <laughs> Porpoise is an asshole. <laughs> okay. All right, if I land this one, we're packing it up and going home because then I can't mistake anything else. I actually want to show you something else. Uh, once we do this landing, I want to show, do another traffic pattern. I want to show you some. Okay. At least we got 30 minutes, so. I was almost a kid. Like every time I do one that's good, like, oh, I can mess up the next one. Well, you're going to mess up something on every land you ever do, I promise. I've never had a perfect land. I don't know, there was one that was pretty good. <laughs> Commander 7760, Alpha, clear of the active at Alpha 3, taxiing to the fuel tanks via Bravo, South Valley. South Valley Traffic, Cherokee, 5923 Whiskey, Base 34 South Valley. Remember your perpendicular. Yeah. So just let me explain. I'm I feel like I was a little close, so I feel I got go wider than I need to, and then it ended up not being perpendicular, and then it ended up messing everything else up. Oh. That's, that's kind of what happens. That's the train of, uh, thought. That's the train wreck. Come on, I'm a little high. South Valley traffic, Cherokee, 5923 Whiskey, final 34 South Valley. Alright. Oop. Yep. Oop. Yep. This actually looks really good, and I wouldn't get on a lower angle than this. Fine, fine, fine. I'll put a little power in. There you go. Put a little power in. Just a little bit of power. It's a solid landing. Just a solid That one. was firm. <laughs> Just a solid landing. Keep it straight. There you go. Back pressure. Okay, let's go. Keep it straight. Super straight. Oh, that was a good wheelie. <laughs> was it? Yeah. Yes! I was trying to do that. I wasn't just trying to take off. Okay, so what happened there is that um, your flare, we were fast again. Speed control key. It's key. You're fast on short final. Yeah, I left the power in because when you said we were on a good trajectory, then we started dropping. We did start dropping there a little, huh? So I put the power in and held it there because then, like, I felt like even though the power was in, we were still kind of coming in low, so... And I think you made the right correction there. I'm not saying that the speed was a bad thing. It's just you need to recognize that. Yeah. And, and... And then what... I told, I told, so what was the... What, what should I have done? On the... On the... And it, 
first flare, when yeah. you went up, uh -huh. just relax. Don't, don't push forward. Don't push forward. But relax the back pressure. And that way we don't balloon as much. That's called a balloon. And balloons happen because of uh, speed in ground effect. So I just need to, just to kind of, just like an inch. Just not even an inch. Yeah, Maybe like a, a, like a small inch. increment. Just a smidge. Oh, I went past the freaking road. Um, South Valley traffic, search 475 Charlie Delta, take off runway 34 South Valley, be making uh, left downwind departure runway 34 South Valley. And those balloons are okay if they're managed properly. And that one was on the verge of not being managed properly. <laughs> Shit. It okay. was it was a firm landing. I'll give you that. It was a flat, it was a three point landing is what we call it. Where all three wheels pretty much touched the ground at once. <laughs> Gosh. Okay. So and just relax. Just relax. The back pressure to offset the the ballooning effect, and then go right back into the flare once it stops the ballooning effect. Okay. So once you're level, you don't want. Okay. Because if you relax too long, you're just gonna, you're just gonna just drop. Boom. Okay. Yep. Which is kind of what I did. And that's what happened. Okay. All right. Cool. I'll try not to balloon, but if I do... Now you know. Now I know. But that's three three landings without my assistance, so... Three in a row. Oh, crap. We need to climb a little bit. Oh. All right. Now I don't need to climb anymore. South Valley Traffic Search 475 Charlie Delta, uh, turn crosswind runway 34, South Valley. South Valley Traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, left downwind, South Valley. Oh, 3-4 is out of there. Okay. I go flaps. Going to turn at the right time, not early. So I don't go wide. bit more power. South Valley Traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, Base 34 South Valley. South Valley Traffic, Cherokee 475 Charlie Delta is left down on runway 34 South Valley. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, final 34 South Valley. I'll wait to put the flaps in this time. Okay. Usually good to have wings level when you do that anyway. Yeah. That was a little weird on that last one. South Valley traffic, Search 475 Charlie Delta is on a uh, runway 34. This is the yeah, site picture we should have. Uh, oh yeah. All the way to the cabin. There's was right there the whole time. Boom. 500 last call. Like it. A lot. <laughs> Sick. Just a little fast. Patient in your flare. Go around. Let's hold it in ground effect before you do anything. So push forward slightly. There you go. Now let's retract one notch. There Not you go. Not too much. There you I go. Was the so now that was a nose here landing. Um, and it was because we had so much speed. I was way too fast. Way, way too fast on that. So again, on final, we got to be shooting for 70 knots. So, on final, I need you to look at that and I want you to verbalize it from here on out. 70 knots. And do whatever you gotta do to maintain that 70. So, 
I had that good sight picture. Too much power with that sight picture. I just needed to start pulling power then. Yeah. And then, and then hold the sight picture. And then, yep, yep. Okay. That's right. Well, all right then. Hey, but you did another landing. <laughs> that counts. I didn't touch a go. <laughs> you I did. touched the ground and I went. <laughs> uh, Skyhawk 5-1 Victor. Uh, holding short runway, 3-4 will be 3-4 departure. Right closed. Left closed. Yeah, idiot. Dummy. Never go right. Oh, actually, on 1-6 you do. On 1-6 you do. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, that was fun. I did a, I did my, a nose gear landing. <laughs> yeah, as the day gets warmer and warmer, I'm noticing every traffic pattern circuit that we're doing, we're getting less performance. Okay. And it's just so minor that it's it's hard to pick up on, but I can tell. That's of the airplane, not of you. Well, <laughs> I think it's, I'm still having fun though. Good. Unlike those other times when it was like just frustration. Yeah. Well, you're like like you said earlier, you're able to process more and kind of recognize what you're doing, what you're not doing, what you need to do. Little bit more, guy. Come on. This one's gonna be real good. Hard all good. What were you gonna show me? You had something else? Yeah, I was gonna show you something, but I didn't want to distract your your landings here. Okay. So when we get to a good spot, I'll, I'll show you. Maybe on the next one. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, base 34 South Valley. South Valley traffic, Skyhawk 51 Victor's turning left, crosswind 34 South Valley. The Husky will follow you down the downwind. You talking to me? So this trajectory looks good, the power setting's high. Okay. Yep. I feel like it fluctuates it a does. lot more. Just because I just looked over there, it was at like 2100. It's because we started accelerating. Our speed on the, the airspeed indicator was fast. And so yeah, the well, engine speeds up. Skyhawk 5-1 Victor's turning. Downwind 4-3-4. Uh, stop and go. Touch and go for 5-1 Victor, South Valley. This is going to look a lot better. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, final 34 South Valley. Let's Did get that airspeed down. There you go. We're going to 90. We're, We're down, down to 85. Perfect. 80. Uh, nice. Now look outside. Way better. It's a little crooked. Huh. Like, little. But so much better. The speed was the, the factor Wh there. Speed was what? Was the major factor there that helped us on that. That was slow? You're, you're right on speed. Well, that's what I, yeah, I was, I was not fast. Yeah. That's wheelie. A little too much on the wheelie. Well, too much back pressure, I mean. Well, that makes me a little sad. Ooh Trying to lower the nose to get faster. And that's what you should do. <laughs> You're having a tendency, and this is not abnormal. I mean, this is normal for everybody in your stage of flight training. Over, over rotating on, okay. the, on the takeoff and on the touch and goes. Yeah. 
All right. I mean, low, low time pilots who have their private pilot ratings uh, still do that. Turning base four, three, four to go, South Valley. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923, Whiskey, left crosswind 34 South Valley. On this next one, I want to show you what we call a side slip to land. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know what that is from watching the videos. And it's a technique. Where you're tilted? Yeah. And you'll do this when you, try, you shouldn't use it as a crutch to get down when you did a bad pattern. It just creates more drag, right? It creates more drag. So you follow quicker? Yep. So what I'm going to do, I'll take over, um, you know, right or beam the captain's bars. Okay. To show you what I want. South Valley, awesome. Traffic, sky up, 5 one Victor's turning final, 3-4, touch and go, South Valley. And I'll give it back to you on short final, and you can kind of land it from there. South Valley traffic, Cherokee 5923, Whiskey, left, down, wind, there's 3-4, South Valley. A side slip to land is used to lose a lot of altitude in a short amount of time without increasing airspeed. And so if you come in on a high pattern one time and you're like, oh crap, I can't get down, I've reduced all my power, I've got all my flaps in and I'm still not sinking, this is what you do. And then you, you correct right before you land? Um, or do you kind of touch one wheel down? No, 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 no. So this is, you don't confuse this with crosswind landings. Okay. This is strictly to lose altitude on final, and then and then you correct and you correct, correct it and okay. then land normal. Okay, sweet. Oh, okay. Dang. Traffic one echo Charlie turning final three four full stop South Valley. And that's actually a forward slip, slip to land. Forward slip. Yep. This is a side slip. Okay. All right, I'll go ahead and take over flight controls. Your controls. My flight controls. <coughs> I'm just going to touch it. Okay, that's fine. See a guy landing there? Yep. So I'm going to intentionally stay high. All right. Oh, okay, gotcha. Uh, but still put in the flaps like we normally would. Stay at 56. Stay at 56 so I can give you back the controls on final. Oh, what? <laughs> Damn it. I was like, all right, Randy's got this one. South Valley traffic, turn red, one end right here, Alpha, trail, taxiing Alpha, two, three, four. South Valley traffic, Cherokee, five, nine, or two, three, Whiskey, left base, three, four, South Valley. All right, now I'll go ahead and let, let it down a little bit. So you do the slip on base or on final? On final. Yeah, we is high. Guy's not clear the runway yet. That's okay. We got plenty of time. One echo, Charlie, clearing Alpha two. South Valley, okay, yes. five one Victor's turning left crosswind three four South Valley. South Valley, Charlie, Cherokee two three Whiskey final three four South Valley. Okay, here comes four flaps. Dang, we are high. Hey, typically you're gonna want to do this into the wind. The wind is coming from the northeast slightly. What I'm gonna do is full left pedal. I'm full left pedal at this point. I'm okay. idle on the power. And then you and then I'm crank just it. cranking the, the wings over a little bit to stay on the center oh, line. Oh, frick. That's a drop. Whoa, that's crazy. And then once we get a little bit lower on the normal flight path, I'll switch it to line up with the runway, which is about right here. So slowly come out of that slip. And if you want, I can land. That's okay, fine. yeah, just go ahead. It's a little, a little late in the game for me right now. Oh, look at that flare. It's beautiful. Oh. Nice. nice. Flaps down. There we go. Let's see if I can wheelie this one. Okay. See how hard this is. Are we wheelied? Not yet. And now we're off. Okay, There's yeah. a wheelie. But you keep pulling back, you need to let the airplane accelerate. There's 85. Yeah, okay. And then start pulling if it you up. pull back, it'll stay slow. Yeah. So I accelerated in ground effect till we got to 85, and then now it's going to be a lot easier to maintain 85 as opposed to trying to catch it okay. up here. Okay. You want to take over? Yeah, my, my controls. Your flight controls. 
So that's a tight slip to land. Yeah, that's crazy. So full, so into the wind, push that rudder side forward. Yep, all the way. And um, then uh, you use the ailerons to counter it. Yeah, and kind of use ailerons to steer you on the center line. Man, that was nuts. Felt those uh, drops. The, the excess uh, free fall. Yeah, we're going down at easily a thousand feet a minute there. Sierra Alpha at the fuel tanks taxiing to the north hangar via Bravo South Valley. Oh, uh, not something that you need to perfect right now. Yeah, uh, we will. We will in the next stage of flight training after your solo. We okay. will start working on those. South Valley Skyhawk Five One Victor's turning base for three four touch and go South Valley. Um, South Valley traffic Cherokee Five Nine Two Three Whiskey. Left downwind, three four south valley. And this will be this will have to be the last one. Last one. Let's make it good. Make it the the best one. Well, you know, it better be good or it won't be the last one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's true. I have noticed though. I went. I rented a one seventy two in New York. We oh, flew yeah. around. Sweet. I have to send you guys some pictures. You threw, flew around the skyscrapers? Yeah. How low are you allowed to go? We were at 1,200 feet. So lower than the, uh, the uh, Empire State. Dang, really? That's crazy. Yeah. But lower than the Freedom Tower. I think the Freedom Tower is 1,270 feet or something like that. That's so cool. So we're lower than that. So you're just flying around the buildings? Yep. Anyway, I was saying, we went, ran a 172, and I feel like that airplane is a little bit le easier to land than this airplane is. It just is so forgiving. So when you guys go to look for airplanes, it's look probably for, probably not a bad idea to consider a Cessna. A Cessna. All right. Plus, you can camp under the wing. Is that a thing people do? Oh yeah. Pop a tent under the wing? Heck yeah. It's like put a tarp over it? Yeah. That's kind of crazy. Never even considered that. Go land out in the boondock somewhere and camp. That'd be fun. That's what it's all about. South Valley traffic, Cherokee, 5923 Whiskey, base, 34 South Valley. South Valley traffic, Trinidad, 180 Alpha, holding in position 34 for departure. Oh, he's like on the runway, just sitting there. He is. What the hell? That's not... What are he, you doing? Uh, he could, sometimes people just hold the brakes, power up, check all their gauges, and then go. Well, he's being a butthole. There he goes. South Valley traffic, Cherokee, 5923 Whiskey, final 3-4 South Valley. Now you're wheeling. See that? Oh yeah, Wait. I did that. I on, pur on purpose. That's what I did. You could wheel it some more. Uh, oh, I never pull it this far back. I probably should. You should. That's that's. I didn't even realize it went back this far, Randy. It went back this far. Okay, what the heck? I'm ta I'm training you. I'm teaching you. All right. Well, yeah, that's like a good four inches for that I usually pull it. Okay, you can relax now. Um, now, by the end of your landing, that should. The yoke should come near its limit. Um, by no means should you be doing that as you're flaring. Yeah. So okay. don't <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> okay. But by the okay, time well that's good to know. <laughs> that's a that's a good thing to know. <laughs> okay. So I, I like like after I touch down, I'm yank, I'm like yeah, pulling just, it all the way, just, which I never have done. But don't yank it. Just, okay. Like, yeah. Yeah. Just, all the just, just ease it back. 
into it, and what that does is it allows all of the um, aerodynamic braking to occur on the elevator. It slows the airplane down more, puts more weight on the wheels, so there's friction. So it just makes so the airplane definitely not coming. It's just more controlled. Oh, I did the last landing when I wanted to. Good job. A little bit harder than. Where, where'd you put the checklist? But you grabbed. I did. Yeah. I don't remember when, but you grabbed it out of that slot. Whatever. You're tripping. All right, let's put your landing light on. I probably should have had that fuel pump. Oh, the fuel pump's been on the whole time. Is that okay in the yeah, pattern? Yeah, in the pattern, it's okay, fine. Okay, good. We'll find it later. So that means I can turn this off then? Uh, yes. That's in the checklist? <laughs> yes, it is. Fuel pressure. So good. Uh, I think... Uh, that's it. I think that's it, pretty okay. much. Let's make a call. Uh... We're at Alpha 3. South out traffic, Cherokee 5923 Whiskey, taxiing to the ramp via Bravo. So that I should have said Alpha 3 sometime. Alpha 3, Alpha downwind departure to the south. Good day. We're on Alpha 3, Good day. taxiing to the ramp via Bravo. South Valley, Sky yes. Alpha 5 1, Victor's turning base for 3 4, touch and go, South Valley. Come on, gag, start moving. Ah, oh, two good flights today. Yes! Very excited about that. I think I had more landings than to go arounds too. You sure did, yeah. Keep going straight. Clearing. Okay. Clear right, clear left. Also turning. My toes on the brakes better. I can't remember what spot we're at, but it's a lot different. Oh, oh I did not fly this time. Five, one, <laughs> turn, final three, four, touch and go, South Valley. Yeah, I'm not flying this time, no. <laughs> When we when you went out last weekend, what were you doing? Just taking him out for like a discovery, or it was a Father's Day thing. We were celebrating. Oh sweet! Is he? Does he fly? No, nobody loves it. But he just and he was out. A, he was in the uh, Coast Guard too, and so he's on boats his whole life. So he's he loves um, just boating and sailing and that kind of thing. And this bring reminds him of doing that. For really? Some reason. Yeah. Just because a lot of the the communication and you know the maritime aspect of it, the the um, the movement of the airplane kind of has some of the same movements. Yeah, because the motion sickness, right? It affects the same kind of people. Yeah, exactly. I actually tend to feel more motion sickness on a boat. Yeah. I went out on a deep sea fishing trip in Alaska, and I kind of, I wasn't sick, but like, I was like, okay, I can get what people are, are, are feeling. Yeah. Never got sick, but I was like, yeah, I feel I feel a little worse than I did before. <laughs> Let's see here. Stop here for a second. Uh, I could have swore that we were. Yeah, we were way back there. Well, I'll just um. That's okay. Let's go take this other spot. Just right here. Yeah. Any number twenty-eight? No, because there are chalks there. Somebody just took off, right? Yeah, they're all leaving their chalks and tie downs there, huh? Yeah. Let's go to this spot. I don't care. Save my spot. I don't care. Back in, right? So, I'm a little wide here and then turn. It's uh, South Valley uh, 59 or 23 Whiskey. Can we get a fuel truck at spot 24? Oh, don't Left put the brake on? Through. We'll put the brake on just to turn off the engine. Take it off. Yeah, that works. All right, so checklist says turn off the landing light. Avionics. Just, avionics off and just pull lean, right? And then we'll turn that off. 